All right, Helldivers 2 has released the patch notes for this week. Uh, starting off, we have our planetary hazards. They are now active. You know, I remember X has not been with us, unfortunately, uh, lately since the 7000 series is having problems. But I remember telling Ghost they should have like fire tornadoes and like dynamic weather while we're at here. And look and behold, this is what happened. Yeah. <laughs> I was just joking. I didn't really mean that. <laughs> well, we took it serious. Now it's there. <laughs> Meteor showers and tornadoes. As if we didn't have enough to deal with. <laughs> uh, and then the erratic, the survival missions, they have uh, double the amount of time it takes for them to be completed. I like that because uh, I they... felt like they were kind of short. Yeah, and also a lot of people were just using them to farm. That's true. So, uh, now they require more kills and enemies spawn more often. So, have fun. <laughs> For the hazards, do you know if they also harm the uh, uh, yes. bugs? Okay. I, yes. Oh, so, did, I have a revision okay. to I lied to you a couple of days ago in a picture that I showed you. That picture that we were talking about, the Illuminate, that is actually a meteor shower that um, oh, okay. actually activates on some of the planets. Um, it does track. You can get hit by it. It does have an AOE effect, and it can also kill the enemy. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Good. I've been yeah, also, I like yeah. I also experienced a sandstorm before I got off earlier today. I haven't oh, really? seen a fire tornado yet. Yeah, it was actually pretty cool. Um, I think it's Fernan, I think is the planet right now that's got a high temperature on it. Um, I was running to do an artillery um, side mission. And it got real hazy real quick, and it's real hard to kind of see through it. So that's kind of cool. And then just to tag on something else that you brought up um, for the um, the survival missions, I jumped into a medium, and on a medium level, you have to kill 225 bugs now versus the wow. 125 that you had to do before. Okay. And did you try, like, on Impossible? I did not try an impossible. I figured that was something we were definitely going to run into uh, later today. I tried to jump into a couple of random lobbies, but they were all full before uh, I had to kind of go back to work on my lunch break. Uh, okay. All right. Uh, well, we got our primary, secondary, and support weapons have been updated. Um, yeah. The family favorite, <laughs> the SG-225 Breaker, has been, uh, has been kind of nerfed. Uh, your magazine capacity is going from 16 to 13, and you got to increase recoil from 30 to 55. Um, I don't think they'll really matter. To, I mean, just for a shotgun, since it has a, a spread on it. Um, you got your Punisher, increased total ammo, ammo capacity from 40 to 60, increased stagger, and increased damage from 40 to 45 per bullet. The... Breaker spray and pray, which I was, which has been considered like completely. Ghost, what is going on in the back? <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. I don't know. I hear like some high pitched. Uh... There's nothing, nothing high pitched over here, brother. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's coming through. Give me two seconds, though. All right. But that breaker spray and pray, uh, they have increased armor penetration. And increased fire rate from 300 to 330. Increased pellets from 12 to 16 per shot. But they decreased the mag size from 32 to 26. Okay. Uh, that, have you, X, you haven't been playing enough, but that breaker, Spray and Pray, I think it's like on the later pages. Like you have to get, uh, earn a lot of medals to be able to use that weapon. Mm -hmm. And then when you get to that weapon, it is absolute crap. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. Uh, so that, so uh, I don't even. a little buff. Yes, uh, a much needed buff because I mean, if you spend that many medals on a, a shotgun, you That's expect true. it. Yeah, yeah. And it would for the spray and pray. Yeah, I don't yeah, even think tough. it would cause the barrels to explode, like the explosive Actually, barrels. It was <laughs> you. You couldn't even kill the eggs. It was so bad. Yes. Uh, it, yeah, wow. it was tough. Yeah, it was terrible. Um, the rail gun, yep. which people are going feral over. <laughs> <laughs> has decreased armor penetration in safe mode and decreased damage against durable enemy parts. So you're going to have to fire a few yep. more shots if you want to break that charger's leg off. Um, yep. I'm okay with this. Yeah, I, I feel I'm okay like, with that too. Yeah, because uh, I feel like too many people using the railgun. 
this isn't one of those games where, you know, it's a favorite because it's the strongest. It's not a favorite just because it's what everybody wants to use. I would prefer to use something else, but it's just, Railgun is just, it's convenient. And I don't have to have a backpack. Also, my armor and my shield, <laughs> my armor is not working, so I kind of need that shield at, at the higher levels. Um, but yeah, the Railgun has been there, thankfully. Actually, I actually did some testing with it earlier today. Oh, really? Gotta go. Yeah, I got to, I got to play with the uh, the spray and pray. It's actually not bad now. Um, the the decreased mag, but the increased pellet count is kind of nice. Um, it, it's actually kind of viable now. Um, as far as just kind of exactly what it is, kind of spray and pray. It's definitely a crowd control weapon. Um, I actually got to play with the uh, the new stratagem buff too. I know we haven't touched on that one, but that's actually really good. But uh, the railgun on unsafe mode takes four to five shots to blow that armor off that leg now. Okay, that's fine. So, I, I like yeah. I'm fine with that. Uh, I, I think people think they're just supposed to get in the mission and just be to run through every enemy type. Like that charger is not supposed to be like a small inconvenience to you. Um, he is there to uh, run over you. Like, that's a behemoth <laughs> with yeah. legs. Yeah. And you're not supposed to feel safe at all in Hell Divers. When you drop on that planet, it's stress. From the time you get there to the time you leave, it is stress. That is how it's supposed mm -hmm. to feel. Now, something I'm very excited about. That flamethrower. Increased uh -huh. damage per second by 50%. Let's go. <laughs> Until you're too close. I was going to say, <laughs> that friendly fire increase. <laughs> Yeah. Also, another one I'm excited about is the laser cannon has increased damage against durable enemy parts, increased armor penetration, and improved ergonomics. Okay, I'll throw that one like, out then. Yeah. Because um, I used to use that in the, I don't forget what the other laser uh, gun that they had in the first one, but they were a great combo. Uh, your shield generator pack. See what goes I'll tell you this though, that uh, Drake actually jumped in with me earlier today. Um, that flamethrower, uh, you have to give yourself some distance. Uh, that will that will light you on fire uh, pretty quickly, especially with pouncers. I've watched Drake kill himself <laughs> about four times today. It was fantastic. <laughs> yeah, because I I think now that you can get killed by your your friends and your your yep. your fire. Yeah. Jesus Christ is dangerous out here. <laughs> uh, oh something i know you'll appreciate uh with this um the shield uh the durability on it so instead of it taking six seconds to come back when they break that it comes back in 12 seconds so uh good luck out there my friends <laughs> yeah that was the next one i was gonna uh, talk about is like you gotta increase delay before recharging also yep. something that definitely need to be worked is the the 120 millimeter and the 380 millimeter barrages they both have increased duration and decreased spread yes the spread oh my god yes because it was terrible like you might maybe be able to kill two bugs you could, <laughs> if you, you could were lucky throw it a football field away and then be sprinting and you might get hit by a stray so <laughs> I remember and then X nothing else one. gets hit by it. <laughs> X threw one a considerable distance away, and the first barrage killed him instantly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like that they decreased it and increased duration because, like you said, it, a lot of times you can miss everything. So tightening that yeah, up exactly. and then increasing the time will give you a chance to hit more, uh, more bugs. Yes. And now I might just switch up my stratagems now with all these fixes, which is what they wanted. <laughs> And they did Which fix the I, armor, I, so yes, there's exactly. that. That's they, what I was they nerfed the shield, but you get your armor back. So if you want the, maybe put the heavy heavy armor on at this point. Yep, that's what. I, or at least medium. I'm gonna see what yeah, the medium true. armor does too. Um, but just some some fixes that they've done. They fixed the armor rating values, which we just talked about. Uh, certain they fixed certain bug holes, including stalker nests that were unnecessarily hard to destroy. That might be a problem you running into ghosts where you thought you were shooting that grenade launcher at the nest and it wasn't blowing up. <laughs> uh, apparently, there's an, they fixed the anti-aliasing toggle, which was not working on PlayStation 5. That's good to go now. Some balanced lighting across planets, improved flashlight, improved visibility, 
during the sand rain weather when a rod or prime. The updated tutorial materials and lighting. Let's see, fix some timing issues that can occur in the extract E710 primary objective. I have no idea, never even, I don't even know what they're talking about right there. Um, oh, they also changed the button interaction behavior for buttons on the yes. bunkers. So. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, yeah so, that needed to be done. Yeah, the first so time I interacted with it, I sat there forever because I thought I had to. <laughs> and I was like, wait a minute, it's done. I could let go. Yeah, you, yeah, you have to, yeah. You could act, and then you find out you can let go pretty quick. Just exactly. After All you have to do is just tap it. That's it. Yeah. Um, you guys can throw snowballs again after being ragged off. Yay! <laughs> You're being able to use grenades after drowning. That's been fixed. Also, one that I, I encountered last night while we were running for our lives, uh, the camera is no longer locked on the player's corpse, which would block you from spectator mode. So that's been okay. fixed. Um, no divers now take damage from fire, gas, etc., generated by other players. So you yeah, got to be more careful out there, yeah, friends. You got to be careful. Yeah. Um, <laughs> armor no longer. Hang on. And then armor is no longer stretching when dismembered. Oh, yeah, that wraps that. up all of our patch notes. And now to get what I really want to is I'm tired of y'all just crying over the internet about uh. the game being hard. The game's name is Hell Diver. <laughs> you are diving into hell. You are not supposed to feel like a god when you're down there. This is not destiny. You don't have any mystical powers. You know, you know what your greatest weapon in Hell Diver is? It is your, your team. Friend. Oh. <laughs> It is your team and the men you bring along with me. That is who you end up surviving with. That is who you rely on for success at the end of the day. Well, and if you do not extract, then you just jump right back in there. I don't <laughs> understand because they have difficulty levels. So just pick something easier. Exactly. If you have problems with it. If you want to go in there and cry, pick something easier. <laughs> they go they go back to Weenie Hut General. Yeah, they give you the capability. <laughs> <Weenie>. to... <laughs> <laughs> to change difficulty, you can select easy missions. Just do that. Exactly. If you can't take it, then leave. That's all I gotta say. Jesus Christ, man! Us, all I see is just people crying on the internet constantly. <laughs> like I, is this is a little bad thing and bad thing about like having a game that's become so popular now? It's because you didn't hear all this crying with the first Hell Diver. You just jumped in there, just had a good time. If you were getting bodied. Yeah, you, you just died figured, with dignity. Now you want to die with dignity. And you just figured this is how the game is supposed to be. <laughs> now this game has reached the Rainbow Six babies, the Destiny oh two, the, the, the Call of Duty idiots who think that oh, I'm just supposed to be the hero. You are not a hero. You are dispendable. They literally <laughs> call in another frozen person every time. <laughs> Get it out of your heads. You are not the hero of the story. None of us are. <laughs> this is. Do I, I just don't. It's a different world. That's all I know. All, everybody just used to get in their way, crying constantly, tweet and tweet all you want to. <laughs> the game's too hard for you. You can play other games. But this right. is how it's going to be. And I am definitely on board for making this game like more team oriented. Uh, people are complaining because the friendly fire is not. Is too strong. No, turn it up. Okay. How about that? That is true. <laughs> turn it up. Because you know, now I've got to make you a better player. <laughs> I'm lying. Because I've gotten used to now. If a teammate runs in front of me, I just automatically just stop firing. Or I've gotten used to you know, let me run or, instead of running in front of him, shooting. I'll just run behind him and and come around that way. You got to think when you're on the battlefield. I, I, we're just not using our brains anymore. I guess we just turn them off when we play. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man, yeah, this is all so I got to say. Been locked up all day. All right. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I got to say. Thank you guys for listening. You guys got any uh, last thoughts? No. No. You, you got to roll out. <laughs> Don't I had to get that out. People. <laughs> all right. Thank you guys for listening. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you never miss an episode. We'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.